Welcome back to my channel, Presence of a Goddess. Thank you guys for joining me today. Today is just going to be a reading for my earth signs. So if it resonates, awesome. I appreciate if you subscribe, like, and share to those who you think it will resonate too. I do appreciate you, tribe. And if it does not resonate, I do apologize. You can check other placements in your chart. And if you want to book a personal reading with me, the link is down below per usual. All right, guys, let's get started for my Taurus, Capricorn, and my Virgos. We're going to see what's the main energy for you guys universe high power what do you have for my earth signs my Taurus, capricorn and my virgo all right something about your kitchen the back of your neck i don't know what that is like the hairs could be standing up on the back of your neck here all right that's spirit so i have the magician the main energy for you earth sign giving me aries energy here you could be creating something okay or you need to put your your thoughts and ideas into action here i feel like you're getting like a lot of downloads of like creative ideas here and it's meant for you to take action all right because the leo the new moon and leo is coming all right i just seen 111 so the new moon and leo which is starting july the 28th i feel like this is a time of creativity because it'll bring you into the spotlight here okay so now i'm going to be using my uh, I don't know what this is. Self-care day. Mm -mm. I'm also getting here. Whatever you manifested with the magician card. Um, it's coming in. Like that's what I'm seeing here. Alright. Yeah, I have dance. So something could be significant with the number 18 here. I'm also getting like spirit wants you to go out and dance more or enjoy yourself more. I'm getting like heavy on the movement, the body movement. Maybe this is something you like to do and you've been putting it on a back burner. But I feel like dancing would definitely make you feel better here. I feel like you tap into your creative ideas more when you dance in. Yeah. And singing. All right. Maybe this is your outlet is dancing and singing. But maybe you lost. Maybe you getting too serious here. So Spirit definitely wants you to have fun with with your life and with your ideas here like make it fun don't be boring okay because maybe you get wrapped up in into like seriousness in your life and you're forgetting to have fun okay so it's like letting your hair down is what i'm getting also the music that you're singing or that pops up in your head this could be definitely correlating with the energies around you here so just be mindful of the music you're listening to because maybe it's something in that song or it's like repeatedly in your head is what's really going on in life in your real life okay yeah i have flow like water all right you could be going to the water like going near water or you may need to soak in some water i'm getting heavy on a spiritual bath here um i'm getting you're tapping more into your spirit game your spirit game trying to like come closer to you to give you a message because she's going deep into the water here and that's like to me that's like getting close to the spirit here okay i feel like spirit has a message for you yeah i have look up the spiritual symbolism of coral reef all right i have abundance planning and you see how that's number one. I feel like that should be your first priority is to plan your goals and to take action here. I'm seeing these as like money. So I feel like it's whatever you're creating or whatever you put into action is going to bring in money. All right. You investing in yourself is going to bring in more money. Okay. Somebody has a cat or want a cat. Somebody could have Pisces in their chart. All right. There's something you've been dreaming about and I feel like it's going to come into fruition for um, some of you guys. Whatever you've been already ma manifesting and putting in the work, it's going to come into like reality here. Yeah, that's what I'm seeing. Like you could have been manifesting this for more than 100 days here. And I feel like it's about to come into fruition. Okay, something about a cat, you are protected and your goals are protected here. So it's kind of like it's time to show out like that's the energy i'm getting for leo season show out okay i'm getting bad energy here so whatever you've been 
you're like your destiny is protected here so whatever these people or whoever these people were that were trying to make you forget like distract you or make you renege that's what i mean renege or like doubt yourself that's all going to be removed because they don't have no business being your business that's what i heard all right i'm gonna get more into the tarot oh something fell out three of cups this is support with the temperance here you you could have sagittarius in your chart be dealing with a sagittarius that's a friend but somebody is very supportive okay i feel like you have a lot of people that are supportive of you okay a lot of people uplift you and you uplift others okay there's a balance here okay something to do with leo or this could be you in a spotlight supporting or creating a platform you're gonna be getting new friends here i feel like you like some like-minded friends are coming in and you guys are gonna like hang out and have fun here like dance and sing okay like this is what i'm getting yeah the two of wands i told you somebody's coming in like this person maybe you have to travel to meet up with them or something this could even be like uh you getting to know someone new because i'm hearing lovers and friends so this could be a lover and a friend it could be a leo here or this could be somebody who's very confident or somebody who's very supportive of you. Like somebody see the star in you. Somebody see the potential in you. All right. Somebody see your dreams here. Okay. This could, like I said, be friends who are um, on the same path as you. You could be seeing 222 a lot here. I just feel like you just need to dive deeper in what you really want out of your life. Like this is a perfect time. And then to put it in action, okay? Even if it's just writing down the steps to this, this is action. Yeah, the star, I told you, with the strength card, Leo Aquarius energy, heavy on the spotlight, heavy on the stardom, okay? You have a strong stardom presence. Even if you doubt yourself, you have really strong aspects of yourself that will make you a star here. You're capable of this. Okay, you could have been through a lot. Okay, maybe people were trying to dim your light. People were trying to hold you back. But I feel like you're overcoming that. All right? I feel like you became stronger than yesterday. Like, you know what I mean? 7 here, okay? Look up angel number 7 But I feel like this is spiritual enlightenment. All right? I'm also getting this as creativity. Somebody really wants to... I'm here at one-stop shop. So you could have a shop. Ooh, excuse me. You could have a shop or you could like be selling something and people, they come to it, they grasp to it because they are into it, okay? For some of you guys, if you have not created this, you need to because people are going to flock to what you got going on here, okay? I feel like you have so much potential and I feel like you're going to go far. That's what I'm hearing. Yep, the hermit card. This is Virgo energy. Spirit had to put you alone to get you away from these people because the Seven of Swords is upside down. So people were exposed when you... So if you feel like you were removed from these people or these situations, you were because they were being fake to you or it wasn't for your higher good here. Yeah, the High Priestess. This is heavy on like a lot of illusions was being placed around you here. Okay, but I feel like you're seeing things for what it is. You could have even seen these things in your dreams. I'm also getting you unlock some type of magic in you. With the magician here and the priestess, you are like magical and you're good at manifesting. All right, somebody could be a healer. Okay, you're healing people in your dreams somehow. Like, that's the energy I'm getting as well. Okay, so I'm also getting here. You had to go through some situation where it broke your heart. But this was meant to happen because it's time for you to... You're, you're becoming in alignment of what you're manifesting. All right, that's what the energy I'm getting. You're coming in alignment of what you're manifesting. And I feel like a lot of people are trying to portray like they were on the same path as you and they're not, okay? They're either going to be exposed or they're, they've been exposed, all right? Somebody thought they were slick as a fox, okay? This could even be a lover love bombing you and portraying like they were your your one, okay? I'm also getting Virgo energy. Somebody was definitely um, observing or like studying you so they can copy you. And this could also be studying you so they can act like you to trick you, okay? 
Um, also, again, like, people like your ideas and be careful because people will steal your ideas. So, be careful who you're telling these ideas to. Yeah, the Knight of Pentacles and the Seven of Cups. You were confused. So, this was what was slowing you down was the confusion. Confirmation. That door did that. So, I feel like this one was slowing you down. This is confirmation. Okay, this was slowing your money down with the Five of Pentacles. Somebody could have ghosted you, but I feel like they were not the one for you because they were love bombing you, okay? I'm also getting, like, these friends that were portrayed to be your friends that were really not your friends, okay? With the Nine of Cups here, I do see you going to be in a better um, space in your life, mentally, physically, and spiritually. Some of you guys are getting your bodies right. You're moving your bodies more, which is definitely helping negativity flow out of you and let money come in. Maybe this is something you had to learn, but I'm also getting here, you are protected and maybe you are feeling safe or you're going to feel safe again once um, things get cleared up and you start seeing things clearly and things are being dropped out of your life. Yeah, because you were heavy on a distraction here. This is definitely a um, distraction. But I feel like you're about to come clear of what you want to create in your life and what you really want in your life. And this is going to start manifesting in fast. Because I've seen 111. That's at a fast rate here. So I'm going to use my spiritual guidance deck, which I will leave the link down below, 1111, okay? You, that means you need to go on and get this. This is for all those who do tarot or into Oracle and need some extra confirmation. These are answers from your higher self. All right. So let's get into it. I'll leave a link down below for you guys. If you're interested. Yeah, trust the process. So everything is not going to be perfect because you could have Virgo in your chart and you want perfection. But everything is not going to be perfect. You just have to be willing to get something done, all right? Because something done is going to turn out the way it should here if you let spirit guide you into this creativity. If you dive into your creativity, into your intuition, okay? Yeah, choose peace. I told you it was a lot of fake people the kettle calling the pot black. I know it's the pot calling the kettle black, but I accidentally put that. Whatever. Hypocrisy isn't cute. So somebody was being a hypocrite. All right. Yeah, there's an energy shift. I told you. Like you're coming into alignment with what you've been manifesting. Okay. The perfect time to take action, especially in Leo season. All right. Happy birthday to all my Leos. Just saw one, two, three, four. So that's heavy on taking action. Yes, yeah, spirit. Spirit trying to get connected with you. You may need, may need to do like some meditation here. But I feel like you're cutting out a lot of people. All right. Some of you guys are eating like fruit bowls or just eating very healthy here. I feel like uh, you're learning who you are. Also, I see you have a lot of uh, a lot of talent, multi-gifted talents, a lot of hands. You could have a lot going on here. But Spirit is saying as long as you prioritize, uh, you should be good. Yeah. Harvest and creation. All right. Follow your intuition with the color purple here. Somebody could be into astrology um, or like spirituality here. I feel like you're going to be open. You're going to be opening in something in your life that's going to create abundance here. Whatever you're creating is going to open up abundance. Whatever you create is going to harvest. You're going to be eating the fruits of your labor here. Yeah, you have a lot of creative luck. All right. Somebody could be into music here. But I feel like whatever you've been through, it could be inspiring you right now. So whatever you're going through, whatever you've been through, put that into your creativity. That's what a true alchemist is. All right, Earth Signs. Um, that's all I have for you guys. I hope this resonated. If you did, you already know what to do. All right. I love you guys. Till next time.